He's okay. You sure? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Making me worry like that. I'd kick your ass if you didn't look like shit. Thank God. Thank you. Okay, let's go. Not sure. <clears throat> yep, it's you, all right. <sighs> what is this? No need to panic. Need 
Can you fight? Stay 
strong. Mind over man. This ain't nothing. Ha. Want some more? <laughs> You waiting? Come on! Check it out! This guy really wants to see us dead!
Don't give up. Bang, bang! The big one's the only one that matters! Now we can concentrate on the big one! Got a whole heap of land with your name on it! to the party and you giving me orders? So how'd you manage to track us down? Followed the trail of bullet holes. There's nobody else I know who leave that kind of mess. <laughs> Oh God, were those people? Yeah. That's the Shinra I know. We need to get him somewhere safe. Everything else can wait until after. Agreed. Let's go. I want you to take Wedge back for me. I'm gonna look around for the others. He made it, didn't he? They could still be alive. <sighs> I saw them both at the pillar. Chessie and Biggs. Saw how bad they were hurt. I'm sorry, but... They've returned to the planet. They... They were supposed to return to us. We stop now. They'll never let us live it down. <clears throat> it's 
So, we carry that weight. I'm sorry. I truly am. We had no other place to go, and... I would never leave a wounded man out on the street. <clears throat> Elmira, I know what you said, but you have to let us go after Aerith. Not this again. We found an underground Shinra lab, where they've done human testing. This wasn't the first time, and it won't be the last. I know these people, and I know they're never gonna let Aerith go. She's the last living ancient on the planet. Think about what that means to Shinra scientists. Especially to that son of a bitch, Hojo. We're all just numbers and meat to him. But... Please. I need some time to think. You've all had a long day. Why don't you go upstairs and get some rest? Can't sleep? No. You too? I heard footsteps. Sorry. Didn't mean to wake you. I'm a light sleeper. It's a soldier thing. <laughs> that flower you gave me the other night? That was from Aerith, wasn't it? Uh. <laughs> 
I knew there was something weird going on. You buying flowers? They symbolize reunion, believe it or not. I was curious, so I looked it up. I tried to keep it alive as long as I could. But now, it's dead and buried. Like the bar, our home, and everything else. from us, again. You're hurting me. Uh. It's stupid. I know that crying's a waste of time. That's not true. Thank you. You've done more for us than we deserve. I won't forget this. If you ever need anything, all you gotta do is holler. Happy to help out, however I can. Elmira. I've been thinking about what you said. She's calling out to me. I can feel it. We all can. So please. She's our friend. We have to help her. Mm -hmm. I always knew it was coming. Knew that one day I'd have to say goodbye to my baby girl. But not yet. <clears throat> Please, bring her back to me. Hmm. <laughs> Hmm? Marlene. Are you going? Uh, I'm sorry, honey. I wish I didn't have to. I wish I could be with you all the time. I really do. But if I stay here, I can't fight out there. Some bad people are trying to hurt the planet. And Daddy, Daddy and his friends are trying to stop those bad people. The slums, your friends, the whole planet. It's Daddy's job to protect it. Hmm? <sighs> mm hmm. <sighs> <sighs> And that's why I've got to go. You remember that nice girl who came to find you? Well, now we have to go find her. And when we bring her home, you need to say thank you, okay? Okay. That girl, she was kind of... <sighs> what? Nothing. You should help her. We will. You'll come back, right? Of course, I promise. <sighs> okay, you can go. <clears throat> P 
Eret. She's tougher than me. Alright, time to get some payback. Don't forget why we're doing this. I know, I know. To rescue Aerith. So, how are we supposed to get topside? With everything that's happened, the trains still aren't running. Well, we could walk along the tracks. The city's on high alert. All the roads and public transit have probably been locked down by now. So what's the plan then? You know another way up? No, but I think I know someone who might. You mean Corneo. Reactors 1 and 5, what do the eco-terrorists do? They go for the trifecta and take out Mako Reactor 7! Another attack by amateurs who don't care about collateral damage! The sky is falling and Avalanche is to blame! But wait! Did you know Wutai is the one funding their activities? For all their claims about fighting for the slums, they're nothing more than pawns of Wutai, puppets dancing to the tune of their foreign masters. And that's the truth. Topside news delivered straight to your ears. That'll be five gil. Five gil, come on. Damn, man. Knew we couldn't trust Wu-Tai to leave us alone. It's the reactors. They want them, we got them. Uh, Does this mean there'll what? be another war? After what they've done, what choice do we have? Five gil apiece, cough it up. The truth ain't free, you know. <sighs> we ain't no damn pawns of Wu-Tai. I couldn't care less about the rest, but that shit? <clears throat> <laughs> no one will listen to us. There's no point in even trying. I'm sorry. Hey. Hey, Tifa, listen. There's no room in this for regrets or what ifs or any of that. All we can do is keep moving forward, keep following this path we chose. Wherever, so we can say we did all we could. I know. But right now, instead of looking forward, you need to look around. Everyone here is terrified. So I'm asking you, don't. I know we're short on time, but let's try to help out wherever we can. And now, the latest on last night's terrible tragedy. The collapse of the Spectra 7 plane. At an emergency press conference held by Shinra earlier, representatives confirmed that the collapse was orchestrated by the eco-terrorist group known as Avalanche. This same group is also believed to be responsible for the bombings of Mako Reactor 1 and 5. In light of this connection, how far could they have gone? Oh, Cloud! Have you seen the kids around by any chance? I haven't seen them since they left to do their patrols. I knew I should have told them to stay inside today. If you do happen to run into them somewhere, could you tell them to come back right away? I can describe them if it'd help. Don't worry. I'll know. Just stay calm and wait here. You never know. They might come back on their own. Okay? Uh, yes. Of course. 
Thank you so very much. I don't do discounts. See ya. Plates aren't supposed to just fall. I mean, what's going on up there? Confirmed that the collapse is orchestrated by the people called the known as I have to tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. I've done it. I've developed a new materia. to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. Hey, you! Cloud, right? Man, am I glad I caught you. Sam, he told me who you are. Said you're a merc, and a former soldier at that. Listen, I hate to ask, but we got a few runaway birds. Mind helping us find them? Poor things were so startled by that plate coming down, they just up and bolted. I'm sure they're around here somewhere, frightened and hungry. <sighs> My poor birds. Worried about them, huh? All right. I think we can help you out. Oh, thank you. When you find them, feed them this. There's three missing all told, and their names are Coco, 
Lolo, and Momo. They'll come on home once they got some food in their bellies. Good luck. I'm counting on y'all. The trains have been running for days now. But those are... I hate being Thank you. I appreciate the help. Please come back safe and sound. Please. gonna do now hey I know you you're Eret's bodyguard I could really use her help she always knew where to find the best herbs and you haven't seen her have you I used up all my meds treating people injured when the plate fell you see I could make more but not without those herbs so what do you need you mean you're willing to help me out oh thank you you'd be doing this town a huge favor Here's a list of everything I'm looking for.
Please, hurry. Time is of the essence. A moment of your time, good sir. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but you're a mercenary, yes? The one I've heard so much about? Oh. Hello there. It is a pleasure to meet you both. I'm a journalist for The Daily Buzz. The Daily Buzz? You mean that trash filled with Shinra fluff pieces? Well, yes, that's fair. But we do get a lot of inside information because of our close ties with the company. <laughs> Curious? Here's the scoop. A certain division of Shinra, that shall remain nameless, was planning to seize Corneo's assets. But before they could, the key to his secret vault, within which his misbegotten gains were securely tucked away, was stolen. And my sources tell me that the thief is the Undercity's beloved hero, the Angel of the Slums! The unidentified bandit who's been targeting anyone with ties to Shinra or Corneo. Yes! That Angel of the Slums! So, do I have your undivided attention now? Kinda, but hurry it up. We don't have time for a three-act play. That's all I needed to know. Here, you can have this. It's a map to the Angel's very own secret hideout. <sighs> what are you asking? If you recover the stolen key, feel free to help yourself to the contents of Corneo's vault. All I want is knowledge, the identity of the Angel. So if you happen to learn anything of value, I'd be tremendously grateful to you if you passed it along. Hey, Cloud. Hmm. Gotta be one of them lost kids. Lost? Who said we were lost, stupid old man? What'd you say? What are you doing out here? And where's everyone else? Well, we saw a bunch of tombstones lying on the ground, so we decided to stand them back up. And then I heard laughing coming from somewhere, and when I turned around, everyone was gone. I was alone. and everyone disappeared. Heads up!
Give them hell! Taking over. <laughs> Deal with that. All right! Watch and learn! Keep it together. I got this. Gotcha. Watch yourself. Don't give up. It's on you. So why'd you kids come out all this way? This is where our parents are. They're resting, but we wanted to say hi. Sometimes you just want to do that, you know? I do. Thanks so much for coming to find us. That's another one I owe ya. We're gonna head back to the house now. Ms. Foley is probably pretty worried. Hey, Cloud. I found this on the ground. You should take it. I think it might come in handy. Bunch of little smart asses. <laughs> With good hearts.
Ain't nothing to worry about. Not a bit.
Hey, look, Coco's back. I can't thank you enough. Poor boy. He's easily the most skittish of the bunch. I was worried sick he might get hurt, but thank God he didn't. The trains haven't been running for days now. Screw you, Avalanche! Cloud? We'll protect the Sector 5 slums. Leave it to us. How you doing, Cloud? We'll protect the Sector 5 slums. Leave it to us. How you doing, Cloud? We'll protect the Sector 5 slums. Leave it to us. How you doing, Cloud? We'll protect the Sector 5 slums. Leave it to us. Mm -hmm. You're just in time for our favorite game, Whack-A-Box. You want in? It's super fun. The rules are easy. The person who whacks the most boxes is crowned champion of the hideout. It's not just a little kid's game anymore. It's practice for the real deal. If you don't look out for yourself, no one else will, you know? Whacking boxes wasn't training us for anything. So we decided to whack monsters instead. Wow, that sounds like a terrible idea. It is not! We've all put up much better scores than you since we started. So why don't you try beating us before you talk? Yeah. <laughs> 
Always looking for more Wacka Box Whackers.
I have to tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help thus far. I've done it. I've developed a new materia. with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? Cloud, I've registered a new summons battle intel request. Please, take a look. I need you to defeat the summon entity so I can complete the materia. I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information for my research. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions.